And it's the Philadelphia Phillies at the Atlanta Braves tonight. I already mentioned the starting pitching matchup. Aaron Nola for the Phillies and left-hander Max Fried for the Atlanta Braves. 7.20 p.m. Eastern time scheduled start. Right now, I'm looking at the total in this game, and that's where my area of concentration is going to be. It's 7.5. Now, you look at, like I alluded to before, you look at this starting pitching matchup, and it looks like a great one, right? You got Nola going for Philly. You got Freed going for Atlanta. But, you know, after diving into the numbers, I'm not so sure this is that great a starting pitching matchup with the circumstances at hand. Now, when I say that, I mean, I, I think Aaron Nola and Max Freed are top shelf starting pitchers. But we're talking about one game situation. We're talking about matchups. And let me go into detail exactly what I mean. Aaron Nola over his last four starts, his ERA is under four, but he's been very fortunate because over that course of time, his whip is 1.67, which means uh, he's wiggled himself out of a lot of jams, and that ERA could should be somewhere around five or more with that type of whip. His last five on the road have been less than outstanding. Uh, 482 ERA, a 146 whip. He's also seen... His last eight starts on the road all go over the total, and opponents have averaged 6.1 runs per game in uh, games uh, at home against uh, Max Reed when he's Atlanta's starting pitcher. Aaron Nola, um, he's made two starts versus Atlanta this year and hasn't been very good while doing so. A 785 ERA, a 165 whip. He allowed four home runs and 10 and one thirds innings pitch. So, as you could see with Nola, although I think he's a top shelf starting pitcher, uh, this situation isn't favorable, especially in the current form he's in, not only recently, but on the road as well. The Atlanta Braves, uh, since August the 1st, um, their ERA is a uh, their bullpen ERA has a 496 ERA and a 145 whip. Atlanta's also, which isn't very good at all. Atlanta's also hit 31 home runs in their last 18 games. And I mentioned that uh, Nola has made two starts against Atlanta this year, and he's given up four home runs in just 10 innings, a little over 10 innings pitched. Uh, since the All Star break, Max Fried has made three starts, and he was an All Star, by the way. So, again, a top-notch starting pitcher here, but in bad form because over his last three starts, a 790 ERA and a 198 whip. That's terrible, folks. Um, he's made two starts against Philadelphia this year, and they weren't very good ones. And his 1080 ERA and 255 whip during those two starts are indicative of such. Uh, the current Philly roster, Philadelphia Phillies roster, let me clarify, uh, has career numbers versus Freed of a 310 batting average, a 380 on base percentage, and a 909 OPS. So these current Phillies on the current roster um, have really touched up Max Freed uh, during the course of their career. Uh, Freed also 8-0 um, and o to the over in his last eight at home. In those games, average a combined 11.9 runs per game. Now, the Philadelphia Phillies have lost four in a row and allowed eight runs per game during that course of time. And their bullpen, uh, a 491 ERA since August the 1st. And they're also uh, the Phillies bullpen, number 27 in Major League Baseball since August the 1st, allowing 1.84 home runs per nine innings pitched. Uh, I like this game to go over the total. I might be in a minority because we've seen this go from eight to seven, the opener of eight down to seven and a half. And I think uh, people are looking at the starting pitching matchup on paper rather than looking inside the numbers, which I just did. I'm going to go Philadelphia Atlanta over the total of seven and a half for my Major League Baseball free pick on Wednesday, August the 21st. Also, folks, if you check Wager Talk TV, you'll see another free pick for me uh, for the second consecutive day in the Cleveland Guardians in New York Yankees game. Don't forget to give me a like, folks. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, uh, which is Wager Talk TV, and uh, click on that alert notification bell. You'll be notified immediately upon any of our great content going up on our great channel. 50% off 
today at Wager Talk for all the handicappers, daily packages or one day access pass. Today only 50% off wagertalk.com. Take advantage of that offer, folks. Until the next time, take care and God bless.